Hi everyone. Welcome to the demonstration on monitoring BDB data pipelines. Monitoring a data pipeline is of prime importance to track the progress of data processing and also to know the history as well as instantaneous statistics of any data pipeline. It is also necessary if in case there are any errors or failures that needs to be traced back. Further, it can also be used to extract important statistical information such as volume of data processed, rate of data processing, verification of the number of records processed with reference to the available or incoming data, both for batch or live loads. The BDB data pipeline module has an integrated data pipeline monitoring section here where one can fetch important performance statistics such as memory and CPU utilization, the number of records processed, the CPU and memory that is allocated, the last processed count, the total number of records processed, the last processed record size, and the number of instances along with the component names. And this is available for each and every component that is part of this selected pipeline. There is also a set of simple visualization charts that is available where the user can fetch quick information regarding the utilization of memory and CPU and also the number of records. And there is also a history available for these three statistics for quick reference. In addition to all these, there is also the component logs that is available for each and every component that is part of the pipeline. We can also obtain overall information on the pipeline, such as the name of the pipeline, the last activated date, the last deactivated date, if there is any, the total allocated CPU and the total allocated memory, and the total amount of CPU that is consumed, as well as the memory that is utilized for the entire pipeline. Also, in addition to the standard pipeline monitoring facility, the BDB data pipeline also offers an option to configure failover events for each and every standard component that is available. The user can create Kafka topics exclusively to handle failures and then drag and drop it into the working canvas and map it with the components. If there are any failures or errors within a component during its data processing, then these are registered in the corresponding failover events. This data by default will have a cause and time of error. And if in case a customized error message needs to be sent, then it can also be configured in the customizable components, such as using custom Python scripts, etc. A simple data audit can be implemented by using the monitoring facility available and the failover events. The user can verify the count of records that were processed successfully as against the number of records available for processing. Just like this pipeline, if we consider the incoming data to be in this Kafka topic, we have a total count of records that is populated. And further, we can also go ahead and find the number of records that were successfully processed. And we can also check and verify if there is any failures. Along with the reason and the time of failure. Further, an additional workflow can be developed on top of the failover event to reprocess the records appropriately and write the data to a specific location which will be part of the implementation strategy that is adopted. The BDB data platform can be integrated with other platform monitoring interfaces such as Prometheus, Datadog, etc. to continuously monitor the pipelines, components, Kafka topics, the published APIs, the various data sources mapped to it, and we can also configure alerts wherever necessary. It is of extreme importance to obtain cluster statistics, to alert in case of any errors or failures within the overall platform or within important pipelines, to check and trace back based on the history of utilization as well as to view the real-time statistics. Therefore, the complete data processing within the data pipelines can be easily monitored in real time along with its history available for analysis by utilizing the monitoring facilities available within the BDB data platform. With this, we conclude this demo on monitoring BDB data pipelines. Thanks for watching.